Oh, we made it! Look how cute our room is! Cute little bathroom. Cute little closet. And the cutest room. This is so cute. What a view. That's where I was walking down there. Uh huh. What a view we have. It's beautiful. You should have seen us trying to get here, y'all. We were in panic mode. We didn't know how we were going to get in this building or park. And people just walk in the streets like it's nothing. Did they, did it cost a did you give it a ticket spit out or something? Yeah, and just pay me leave. Did it say how much? No. We got what, like a mile? Or two? I'm hungry. You want me to show you where it's at? I, I, I looked. I saw you. You should have seen me checking in. I've never checked into a hotel by myself before and I'm shaking. Right here. Yeah, I'm looking for the street I was on. You should have been just right there, the street behind us. Yeah, but I think I'm like down here. Amazing. Need to put on some extra deodorant. <laughs> we made it. Tomorrow we leave so super early for. No, I'm on this street actually. I'm like down here. <laughs> Tomorrow we get on a plane super super early. I think we leave at like 5 30 in the morning and we're going to cancun my whole family is going and i couldn't be more excited i hope we have good weather and i thought i would go ahead and pick up the camera while we are in new orleans i found this cute little black dress and some sneakers it's super super hot and muggy here so I think we're about to go try and find something to eat for lunch and see what we can find. Walk around, maybe go get... Oh, I actually want me to show you where I park. Maybe go to Cafe Du Monde. It's a dark elevator. That's got beer, so I'm just close me off. That's kind of spooky. It's like a haunted house. We're out in Disney World. Power chair. Yep. <laughs> hmm. Alrighty, we are sitting in front of the French Quarter. It is so pretty and I think we're about to go get some beignets at Cafe Du Monde. He's never had them. Uh -huh. Oh, you have? A beignet, yeah. Oh, from here? Yeah. Oh, so we're going to go to Cafe Du Monde. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. And then we'll probably head back. I want to drive by the airport because I'm nervous about where to go. I've never been to the New Orleans airport. And we're going to check that out and then probably just relax at the hotel since we have to be up probably around like 2 a.m. Because our flight is so early. Guys, it's 2.30 in the morning and I'm about to get ready to go to the airport. We have to be there by like 3.15, so. Wow.
because they're sick. Let's wipe your sweat. <laughs> Not mimosa. Not mimosa. No, what's that called? We probably have some CBD. Oh, I hope so. My God, it's all over. Oh, that's nice. Here, let me help. He's in the second floor. See? Okay. We made it. How cute. This is our little room. The little bathroom. Cute. This is our view. It's a little cloudy today, but I think it's supposed to go away. The hurricane weather. At least it's already came. Alrighty, it's a little bit later and I just finished unpacking everything from our luggage or from mine at least and I thought I would show you guys. So I put like all of my facial products and stuff right here and I put everything in our shower and then I unpacked or all of my clothes. So I have like all of my tank tops and then some nicer shirts and some dresses. Then I have some easy throw on cover ups and beach sets. And I also brought my little bag. I have some extra shirts up there. Then I have all of my shoes. And then over here I unpacked, I unpacked like my pajamas and stuff. And then I put all my bathing suits and cover up. Then I did just active wear type stuff. Not going to be wearing this too much. And then lastly, I put jeans over here because I ran out of hangers. So, just finished all of this. If y'all haven't heard of these Rag and Bone jeans, they're amazing. They are pricey. And I did have to size up. These are great jeans. Then I got these Zara jeans. They're the wide leg jean and they are great. I, I sized up too big in these, but I did want an oversized like looser fit and I had to hem them myself, but I just cut them with scissors. So we are unpacked. Baser has been relaxing, watching sports and we're about to change clothes and head to the pool. It is a little bit later in the afternoon, but I figured why not we can just put our bathing suits on and go relax at the pool before dinner I'm not sure which restaurant we're gonna go to so this is an all-inclusive resort so you can kind of bounce between we're staying at moon palace so it's like an all-inclusive resort but there's three resorts in the resort and you can kind of bounce between each resort and um, we're staying at sunrise We just got back from breakfast. We decided to stop and go to the gym afterwards just for fun. And it's a little bit cloudy today. It's like overcast. And I just put on this swimsuit. I put on this black swimsuit I got from Everything But Water. Um, so we're about to go hang out by the pool and just hang out with family. Everyone is headed there. So. I probably won't take my camera, but I might bring my phone and take a couple of clips on my phone and then come back and get ready for dinner later. It's only like 10 o'clock, so we'll probably be at the pool all day, eat lunch, and then come back in. And yeah. Hello. We just got in from the pool and changed clothes, got ready for dinner. Um, Vazor is tired. I have on just this like white knit crocheted type top with just some blue jean shorts. We're just going to like a steak restaurant, like a simple steak restaurant, so I didn't want to get too dressed up. Then I have on just these simple sandals that I got from Target with just some very basic everyday jewelry that I have on. So, got a little bit of sun today, even though I thought it was overcast, but it's a great day. We hung out at the pool today and yeah, we are about to head to dinner. Baser has on golf shirt and golf shorts. Yep. Alrighty, we'll catch y'all later. Oh, oh, oh. Look at all the 
the butterflies that just swung to this. Girls! Boys! <laughs> Bye! We're walking to dinner. Jack, look. Smile! Oh my god. Is it a video? Hello, you guys. I just got ready for dinner. We're going a little bit earlier tonight. I wanted to get dolled up a little bit. I have quite the tan line. And Bazer's finishing getting ready. He's picking out a shirt. So I'm going to go down here and take some cute pictures for Instagram, or at least try to. And everyone else is getting ready. We spent all day at the pool today. It was a beautiful day. We had such great weather, and we hung out with everybody. It was really good and now we're about to go to texas day brazil it's not actually texas day brazil but we have one just like it on the resort and it has the same concept so we're gonna go to that tonight for supper and it is actually at the resort over it's at the nizuk resort we're at sunrise so super excited about that we're gonna go take some pictures and i'm gonna show you guys what i'm wearing let's see where i can put it put it right here really good angle I have on this Zara tank and some Zara jeans Headed to dinner. We are headed to Mexican tonight. We've been at the pool all day. Tomorrow, the boys are gonna go play golf, and we're gonna hang out, hang out at the pool. And then tomorrow, the girls are getting massage. And then Wednesday, we're gonna go to the water park. <laughs> Is that what you're recording? <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> what was that? Yeah. Alrighty, I just came in from the pool. The boys played at golf today. I think I've mentioned that. And they had a lot of fun doing that. So they were gone like all day. And the girls stayed at the pool. I got a little red, but that's okay. Because I don't normally burn too bad. So I just got out of the shower. I'm about to get ready for dinner. Baser is still at the pool playing volleyball. I thought I would show you guys some of the products I've been putting on because it's been a game changer and it's prevented me from peeling. So, and this. So, every morning I put this on. I started doing this at home as like almost like a makeup. I don't wear much makeup. And this has helped my face tremendously. My nose normally burns very easily and it, it's a little red, but game changer. You need this. And this is the tinted. And then I've been putting this on my lips, which everyone knows this is amazing. That doesn't necessarily have sunscreen in it though. Okay, so I washed my face with this first, which is the Ocean Cleanser from OC. And then I put on this hydrating cream. And I do these in the morning. And then at night, I'll wash my face and put on the cream. And then also put on this. And then I also put this on. And this is kind of like old. People used to rave about this like a year or two ago, but I'm still obsessed with this. I have really, really dry skin and this really helps my skin. So I do all four of them at night and just these two in the morning with the Elta MD. And then also I've been using this body oil. 
I just got this stuff for this trip and I mix this body oil with this eucerin lotion and this is like yeah this is a super rich one so it's really thick if you don't have super dry skin then I would not recommend this because it's almost like a Vaseline it's very I don't know I guess greasy kind of almost like it gives your skin a shine I don't know if you can see it um and then on with this as well I just do like one pump of this so thought I would show you guys that so we're going to Italian tonight and I can't decide what to wear I kind of want to wear this dress but I wore this to a wedding not too long ago and that kind of bothers me to be an outfit repeater but or I can wear this little Zara shirt that's super cute but it's kind of revealing but I might try this on or I might just wear this like long sleeve let's see it's almost I used it as a cover-up the other day but it's like a white button down and I might like tuck it into one side of my jeans or jean shorts or I can wear this little black shiny tank I love this tank top this is a free people tank top but it just doesn't go with much and it doesn't really go with the Italian vibe for tonight and neither does this little pink sweater shirt let's see here these Zara jeans I wore the other day they're amazing I highly recommend but I think I'm feeling shorts okay so I think I'm gonna wear this these little JBD jean shorts and then this white button down with this little skims bralette underneath and I'll probably tuck in like one side of these into my shorts I think that's like the style and then I'll wear this little dumpling bag with it with a bunch of jewelry and I have all my jewelry in this little bag and it's driving me bonkers because I need a jewelry case I think I'm gonna like load up on the jewelry tonight these are basic swimsuits that are drying so this is the fit for tonight unless i change my mind and i'm so excited we are headed to italian for dinner tonight and i think i showed you guys my outfit but i ended up changing into this little free people top my little bag and then these zara jeans with my dolce vita heels they're super easy to wear and these jeans are my new favorite i've worn them already on this trip and I'll probably wear them again. So, we are headed to the lobby. Everyone is waiting on us, and I'll probably vlog our food. I know I haven't been very good at that. It's been kind of hard to vlog here because I don't want my camera to overheat or get wet. So, I will definitely show you the food for tonight. I want to know if dinner now. Okay. <laughs> to dinner it is Tuesday night we're just going to a super simple easy dinner so I threw on this little white set I got from Hemline last year and I have on my Target sandals it's a little yellowy in here from these lights these lights are terrible and I washed my hair but I didn't put on any makeup at all so let's go to dinner I look exhausted our last full day here today is Wednesday and today is my birthday and I am 24 
four years old. <laughs> My hair looks crazy. <laughs> Just went on the balcony and it's so windy. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to go get breakfast. I love the bagels here with the <laughs> Nutella. <laughs> And we're going to get that. Then we're going to go over to the Grand. They have a water park. And we're going to hang out over there all day. Ooh, they also have a bowling alley, they said. Yeah, they have a bowling alley. And there's a couple of... There's a couple of other things over there that we can do. So. And I might bring my camera. I don't know. It's a little bit easier sometimes just to take it on my phone. I don't want to get my camera wet, so. I'm actually not going to wear jewelry. Or like hand jewelry. I forget how salt this is, Phil. Yeah, that shirt's off. There's stuff all over it. Where? On the front. Oh, I need more than once. I don't know, you can't keep anything clean. Alrighty, we just got back from breakfast and we are getting ready to go over to the Grand. We are about to head over. I'm not going to bring my camera just because I don't want it to get ruined. I will take some clips on my phone of the water park and all of that good stuff. So, that is that. I wanted to show y'all. We got some goodies from the gift shop for like friends and family. We got some stuff in here. It's like all wrapped up, but we picked out some goodies this morning after breakfast. We got that cute little bag. And yeah, we're about to walk over to the Grand and I'll catch up with you guys later. So we just got back from the Grand and the housekeeper left me a little surprise. Isn't that so cute? They're like little cake pops and then also some champagne, I guess. So I'm gonna get ready for dinner and then we're gonna pop the champagne. from breakfast and taking our COVID test. And I just put on my little airport outfit. This is Baser's first time coming and this is my like third or fourth, I can't remember. And we love it here. So we'll definitely be back soon. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go ahead and close it off here because I'm not gonna video at the airport. So, alrighty, thanks for watching.